Hi, welcome to the system. This is Arch Labs 5.0 R2D2. I've just installed Solus Budgie and I thought, um, well, I was not, um, I was interested to see if, 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 what are these others? Eh? You have GNOME, you have Mate, and these are uh, other uh, desktop environments you can install with Solus. So, like I said, um, this one is already installed, so I'm gonna pop in a new image. Let's see, let's take GNOME first and then open, start, and let's have a look how we can install this. So I'm booting from the ISO. It's too bad, we have again a small screen. And there is, I don't think there is a way to make it bigger, as it is so small now. You can make it, of course, something like that, but that's not really, that's like a yeah, zoom in, zoom out, something like that. It's too bad that we cannot have it <coughs> another way. Oops, that's my mistake. Um, so we're going to install it. Yeah, it does find my uh, position. That's better for me that my keyboard is already in order and all that. We're gonna replace whatever we have. So let's have a good look. Erase all content on this disk. And this is, I think this will be the best one. I want to erase everything. So, add now, next please, next please, okay please, all right, that's done, let's uh, see what we have in the meantime. So we have this program running in the background, we have these, the file manager, and we have GNOME MPV, written box, hex chat, Firefox files, we have the, the wired localization live user logout and so on what do we have here we have as you can see the cursor is the the snow the, the breeze snow cursor okay can we make our display in here maybe let's have a look again was well, the same issue when um in budgie so i guess it's uh, gonna be also the same issue on mate might be something i do wrong i don't know okay we are almost at the end so we have these overview and we have seen that already and then the locking which we're not gonna do now we see the show and we see the applications these are the mocha icons the mocha files and we have here the arc folders so it's a combination of arc and mocha folders that's provided standard out of the box and let's restart now right um Let's see if this works. Again, it does not work, so no problem. All we have to do is tell them that there is no ISO inside and then restart again. So, April 18th. Oops, did I ask to auto login? I don't know, I don't think so. Was that not a possibility? All right, anyway, we're in. Let's give it another go. No, not possible. So that will be that. So we have all this information here and the software is there. We can have a look at the software center. 
for me this one is the most important one but I know already from the uh, budgie version that it's the same there's no more icons to be made for the surfing or the uh, Saturday icons let's take a download let's do a download so what you're looking for you're looking for the Saturday icons oh my god I did something wrong I mean QWERTY let's see if I can figure that out that's a good exercise for me keyboard let's see where that should be uh -huh. oh well, actually we should do it like this I already saw the icon I think but um, we can do it like this that's nice so English it is and Belgian I want Belgium so Dutch Belgium in Belgian keyboard add get rid of this one so there's only one keyboard available can't make a mistake the other one I will never use ever so that's good let's try to do Wasardi we have some information here normally you would try the first link there is and then you see ah, SourceForge has all the files and then you download it and you wait while we wait let's go again to Eric Dubois and then the surfing icons as this one download save do this automatically okay it's here let's see what we have already extract here that's that now where are the Saturday icons there they are that took long come on source watch so this one we can extract here as well and we can do two things at once Control C and then Control H new folder call it icons put it in here back to the downloads to the surfing these are no icons and everything else is and control V now let's take a look normally in budgie we have this raven panel so how do I activate my icons that's a good question so what applications do we have to activate it let's see the settings settings display A normal person would type icons or they would type themes or something like that same applies in here you would type icons or you would type themes and there we have our tool so remember the tweak tool is the one we want we don't need this one we do want another icon and the uh, I'm gonna take the blue one all blue one and we can now check it out so everything is blue should be blue anyway it's easy for me to see if there are icons missing and if we go to the files here we should go to the other location to the computer to the user to the share to the applications and there we have also icons some of them have no icons that's quite normal that's because they don't have icons it's set in here it's a desktop file you can open it with something else and you'll see that there is no reference to an icon and you don't get anything as simple as that so okay um that uh, looks good let's keep that open let's get back to our tweak thing so tweak tool let's pin him there Add to favorites and there he is um, what I was doing what I wanted to do is so let's take something nice because I really don't like that kind of icon theme Saturday Mononumix is a completely different look um, so anyway you have 20 different kind of looks look so we can go over them 
but that will take too long. Just move them. Oh, that's uh, very small. Yeah. Okay. So move them all over. So move it like this. So let's see if the arrows work. How the arrows work. So all these kind of icons, 20 kind of different folders and icons are there. These are the servant icons we're watching. And here we start with the set icons. So any of these apply or can be applied. And here we're back in the, the Mocha and the Faba, as you can see. So, all right. Um, I guess there's one last thing I want to see before I stop the tutorial here, the video. That is, I would just want to go over the icons here. So this would be the look if you choose surfing. And it looks good. That's a polo look. That's a blue one. It goes together with the GTK theme from Arc, Arc Polo, which is not the standard blue, but then the real blue. I mean, <laughs> Arc Polo blue. We can go to dark. Also nice. Uh, here I wanted to push. Yep. Yeah. Okay, fine. So the surfing and the icon arc themes are okay. Where we're looking at the gnome, Sol's gnome. All right.